Okay, well, this is uh, the little jewel thief that I started at the beginning, and uh, that's now into the eighth day. And what I mean by that is that has been on, those lights have been on for eight straight days. And every morning I get up and I take the battery that's on the charge side and I put it on the, the run side. And today uh, this was at 1.14 and this was at 1.24. And they both started out at 1.35 and that's after eight straight days. Now there's the second one that I built and that's the little boxed one and that's on its fifth day and that one uh, I just have a switch here that I flip back and forth between the A and the B battery and just leave it alone let it run and that's going on to the day five and that's the, that is the circuit right there that uh, I'm using um, and the question is resonance so what's going on as far as resonance here and is that why this is uh, doing its thing and that's the question uh, we're all asking uh, why? Why does this go so long? And uh, is it uh, is it resonating? And I think so. I think we've got something going on in the coil area here that's causing this to ring the bell. And that's I think that's what's happening is these coils are resonating here. And anyway, I've got another one set up here. Um, I found out that I could do this with just a little air coil just a wires wrapped together in an air coil will make this do its thing and uh, there's the the sine wave on it and uh, I'll make this a little cleaner and that's with the thing dialed down to well this is at 40 milliamps the the systems over there are running at about 20 milliamps or less but I, what I wanted to show here was the resonance um, on this system changes as you vary the voltage going into the base on the system I've set up here uh, I'm just varying voltage with a potentiometer here at the base of the transistor which turns everything around on itself but the question uh, arises are we doing a uh, tuning of resonance or does the thing self resonate as you vary the the settings on it now what I want to show here on the scope is I'm going to dial up on this potentiometer the voltage in the system and right now it's running but the LED the little LED is not even on but I'm going to turn this up and watch the waveform change as I turn this up and the question is is this still resonating but is this resonating at different frequencies and that's the question and I don't know I don't know, but as I turn this up, you can see the LED light comes on. It comes on brighter and brighter and brighter. It goes down, brighter and brighter and brighter. It goes down. I'll turn this up. And that's with the little air coil. And I found this air coil was real um, real interesting because... Let me turn the light on. What I initially did was I wrapped that on that battery. I thought I could use the battery as the core. Instead of a ferrite core, I found out that you can use just regular steel and it'll actually run. But I wrapped it up on that battery. And then I found out by accident, pulling that thing off, it actually got brighter. Let me put this on. I'll show you the light will actually probably go off here. Yeah, there goes the light. It doesn't really like having that in there. It would rather be an air coil. So anyway, I just decided that... Um, for whatever reason, this resonance will happen without even an inductor in there. I mean, without a core. That this this waveform, I don't quite understand. That's pure sine sine wave right there. The system's running, and then as I increase base voltage, it just goes very strange. And uh, this is uh, collecting a signal between the collector and the base is how that I've got this set up. I can collect signals from different places on the circuit but that's the signal between the collector and the base on that little transistor down there, that little 2N222. But um, anyway, like I say, that to me that's when the bell's ringing right there was when you get a waveform like that. 
But the question is, when we increase this, is this still resonating, but this is just resonating at different frequencies? And I, I think so. I think what's happening here is this circuit, this little coil right here, does its thing automatically. And as you increase the, um, the juice to it, this just goes into different resonances. And it just depends on what I mentioned before in one of my posts was that it's a balance between what you want to draw out of the source battery and what you want to put in to the charge battery and what you want to get in the way of light. And it's this balancing act between what you want to pay for the, for the light, which is that's the amp draw right there, and what you want to put into this, the charge battery and then what you want to get out of the light. And then that's what it looks like on the screen. Now, if I had the radio, you could hear this going in and out of these frequencies. And that was the voice of the jewel thief that I posted on other, another video. But evidently, I have these dialed in to where they need to be because that should run 200 hours based on the calculations that I've done. And I think it's going to exceed that. I think this is actually going to run beyond 200 hours. And <clears throat> I think I just somehow got that inductor wrapped correctly. And I have this setting uh, correctly on the uh, waveform to get that into the correct resonance and the uh, balancing act between amp draw light and charge. So anyway, that's the latest on my little... Uh, resonance experiment with the jewel thief.